Okay, hello, hello, good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Okay, so let's see. Welcome to your EFL good class. Morning. Yes, morning. Okay, uh, on Tuesday we have the EFL class. Yes, okay, so you saw some exercises at home of your book. That's main page 66. Yes, did you complete this part? Morning, Miss. Morning. Okay, did you complete it? Completamos el ejercicio de la página 68. Yes? Okay, yes. excellent. Okay, that's good. Remember, mm -hmm. this one is in your agenda. Yes. Los que nos... Okay. Los que nos quedamos en casita, teníamos que trabajar esa página el día martes. Okay. Porque el día martes no tuvo clase, pero sí tenía una guía de trabajo. Y los que fueron al colegio, pues en el colegio lo desarrollamos. Pero los que se quedaron en casa, sí debían trabajar esa parte. Okay. Yo sí lo hice, Miss. Ok, excelente. Ok, that's good. Ok, so let's see, let's practice. Yes. In that part, ok, so we talk about there was and there were. Do you remember? Yes? Okay. So let's review this part. Let's see. Okay. We talk about there was and also there were. Yes? Okay. And remember, there was, you use this part, okay, when you talk about singular. Yes? Yeah? Singular object or person, yes? Okay. And there were, when it is plural objects or people, yes? Okay. Solo estamos haciendo un repaso, de acuerdo? Okay, there was, there were. What is the meaning of both in Spanish? This one is había, yes? Okay. So we say, había. Okay. Había un carro. There was a car. Había unos carros. There were cars. Okay. Entonces, cuando hablamos de there was, there were, the meaning is había. But what is the difference? You use there was with singular objects, okay, or person. And you use the where with plural objects or people, but in past, yes? Usted habla de ellos, pero en pasado, no en presente, yeah? Okay, so let's see. Now we practice this part, yeah? Okay, let's check. See the picture, okay? So what is that Hola, place? Me. Hello, Rudy. Okay, what is that place? What part of the house is this one? ¿Qué parte de la casa es, chicos? Lo que ustedes ven en pantalla, la imagen. ¿Qué parte de la casa a es? Bedroom. A room. Okay. okay. This one is a bedroom. Okay. This one is a bedroom. And we have a lot of objects here, yes? Teddy bear, some blocks. What else? Um, little. Uh, paper, um, balloons. Okay. Balls. Balls. Um, cars. Okay, car. Alison? A train. Okay, a train. Um, Okay, some we books. Teacher. Tell me. ¿Cómo se dice alfombra en inglés? Ah, okay. This one is a? Mm. Carpet. Okay, carpet. Car mm -hmm. Carpet. Carpet. Okay, some curtains, a window, etc. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay, so let's see. Now, you see the picture, so you help me. Okay, so you choose was, where, wasn't, or weren't. Okay, remember, was is for singular things, 
word is for plural things. Wasn't, no había, only one. Weren't, no había, but two or more, yes? Okay, there, balls next to the bed. What is this one? There was, there were, there wasn't, or there weren't? There were. Okay. There were, okay, because we have one, two, three, yes, three balls next to the bell. So we use were because this one is in plural. Number two, okay, there was, were, wasn't, or weren't a dog in the room. Wasn't, wasn't. Okay, there wasn't, yes, no había un perro en el cuarto. There wasn't a dog in the room. Okay, so let's see. Number three, Alejandro Romero. There, a carpet on the floor. What is the correct answer? There was. There was, okay. There was a carpet on the floor because we talk about only one. Okay, let's see. Alison, number four. There are books on the bed. What is the answer? There were. Okay, there were books on the bed. At the end, we check the answers, yes? Okay, so let's see. Number five, there, a wardrobe next to the window. Okay, wardrobe, if this one is when we put the clothes. Es donde ponemos nuestra ropa, okay? Ropero. Okay, there, uh, let me check, Alejandro Mendoza. There was, there were, wasn't or weren't a wardrobe next to the window. I miss. Hola. Um, there weren't. There weren't, okay. A wardrobe next to the window. So let's see, next one, Paulette. There are teddy bears in the basket. Okay, check the picture. There are teddy bears in the basket. Okay, what do you think is the answer? There was, there were, there was another word. Okay, Paulette, she's the only one. Wasn't, okay. So let's see, number seven. Okay, there, a cushion on the bed. Okay, a cushion is similar to pilo, yeah? Cojín, yes? Okay, so let's see. There, let me check. Uh, let's see, okay. Mateo Salmeron. There was, there were, wasn't a word, a cushion on the bed. What do you think? There, there, okay. there was. There, there was, okay. So let's see, there was. Daniela Blandon. There, a train between the bed and the wardrobe. Between the bed and the wardrobe. Okay, so this one is the bed. In the guarro, between the bed and the guarro, we have a train. Where? Okay, there where? So let's see. There is sleepers under the bed. It's sleepers, where are the sleepers? Pantuflas, yes? Okay, what do you think? There was, there were, there was another where, and the sleepers under the bed. Weren't. Weren't, okay. So let's see. So you give me your answers, yes? Okay, right now we check and we obtain our grade, yes? <laughs> vamos a chequear y vamos a ver cómo estamos de nota. Ah, okay, so let's see, let's check. Number five, six, and number eight are not okay. Yes? Okay, there weren't a water up next to the window. You say this one, okay? Si sí, tenemos un armario a la par de la ventana. Por lo tanto, esta respuesta era, there 
was, okay? A war role, because we talk about only one, we say there was. There wasn't teddy bears in the basket, okay? Hay, habían ositos de peluche en la canasta, estamos hablando en plural. Entonces decimos there were, okay? And the last uh, one, there were a train, okay? En este caso era, there was. There was a train between the bed and the wardrobe? No, there wasn't, okay? Teníamos que elegir there wasn't, porque no hay un tren entre la cama y el armario. Yes? Okay, so we have seven. <laughs> so we continue practice, yes? Okay, now we pass to our book. Okay. So let me check this part and this one. Okay, so this one is on page 67. Please open your book, page 67. 67. Okay, so in that part you listened, okay? So this one uh, is a conversation. So you listen the conversation and you write a stick or maybe a cross. Yes, so you write tick or maybe cross. Ok, voy a escribir un cheque o una cruz, dependiendo de lo que diga el profesor, ok, dependiendo de lo que le guste, si le gusta una película, si le gusta el libro, ok. So, pay attention, please, preste atención para que usted lo vaya haciendo de la manera correcta, ¿de acuerdo? Mi hija okay. encuentra mi libro. Mm, but you need to check, ok, yo dije en la clase de las 8, al finalizar, busque su libro, téngalo listo, ok. Let's start. Track 67. Listen and mark. The Wizard of Oz is my favorite movie. I also love the book, but it's different from the movie. In the movie, there was a professor. There wasn't a professor in the book. In the movie, there was one good witch. But in the book, there were two good witches. In the movie, there were red shoes. In the book, there were silver shoes. In the movie, there was a tornado. There wasn't a tornado in the book. And in the movie, there were great songs. Of course, in the book, there weren't any songs. Okay, did you complete? Yes? Okay, yes. let's... Let's check. Okay, you have the answer here. Do you notice? <laughs> okay, so let's listen. One more Track time. 67. Listen and mark. The Wizard of Oz is my favorite movie. I also love the book, but it's different from the movie. In the movie, there was a professor. Okay, that girl says that in the movie, there was a Professor, yes, okay, for that reason you write a tick, okay, or you tick, escribe un check in the movie, because there was a professor. Okay, let's continue. There wasn't a professor in the book. Okay, and the girl says that there wasn't a professor in the book. In the movie, there was one good witch. But in the book, there were two good witches. Okay, All right. I'm sorry. So it says that in the book, what happened? There was one witch, yes? But in the movie, what happened? Okay, but in the book, there were two good wishes. So let's see. In the movie, there was only one. For that reason, we cross, yes? And in the book, there were... Two good wishes, yes. So for that reason, we tick, yes. 
Ok, por eso le pusimos un cheque, porque dice que en el libro sí hay dos buenas brujitas, pero en la película no. Ok, so let's continue. Ok, red shoes. What happened with the red shoes? There were red shoes in the book. Yeah. There were silver shoes. Ok, there were red shoes in the movie and silver shoes in the book. Yes. Ok, red shoes in the movie. Silver shoes in the book. Ok, tornado. What happened with the tornado? There wasn't a tornado in the book. Ok, tengo un micrófono activado, pero yo no lo puedo apagar. No me, tiene, no me da la opción. Así que, por favor, debería hacerlo usted solito. Ok. So, let's see. There wasn't a tornado in the book. So, for that reason, we write across. Ok. And in the movie, there were... There was a tornado, yes? And what about songs? There were great songs in the movie. But in the book, there weren't any songs. Ok. En la película no había, en la película se había, pero en el libro no. For that reason, we write a stick or maybe a cross. Yes? Ok. Did you see this movie, The Wizard of Oz? No. No. Ok. And did you read the book? No. No. Ok, so let's see. This one is an interesting movie and also an interesting book. Yes. Ok, so if you have the opportunity to see, that's ok. Yes. Ok, Gabriel. Do you need to tell me something? I have seen the Ah, ok. Excellent. So let's see. Let's continue, yeah. Um, I remember when I, wa I, am, I was studying okay, at the university, I performed the Wizard of Oz, yes, and I am the witch. <laughs> I was the witch. Me tocó personificar a la bruja. <laughs> yes, when I studied at the university. So it was a funny activity. If I find a picture, okay, I show you. Si encuentro una foto de cómo me vestí, se la voy a mostrar, okay? Voy a tratar de encontrar, ¿de acuerdo? Para que me vea como una brujita. <laughs> okay, so let's see. Now, this one, the last part, read and match. Okay, so let's see. This part, in the movie, okay. Was there a professor? According to the information that we have. Okay, yes, we say, they yes, they was. Okay, yes, they was. Let's see. Were there any songs? Habían canciones? Okay, what happened? In the no. movie? In the yes, movie? There yes, there were. Okay, were there any songs? Yes, there were. Okay, listen this part. If you have a question with that expression, Please that's me. Okay, tell me, Mateo. Uh. Vamos, ¿se lo puedo decir en español? Tell me. Se lo puedo, se, no de que si cada color, cada cuadro, vamos a, vamos a llevar la línea al donde le corresponde del color. Yes, ok, if it is blue, with blue, yeah. Bye, gracias. Ok, so let's see, were there any songs? If the question is with where, That's mean the answer is with where. Si usted en la pregunta tiene la palabra where, quiere decir que en la respuesta va a ser where también. Yes. Okay. <coughs> I'm sorry. Okay. So let's see. Uh, <coughs> hi. I'm sorry. I have okay. A okay. What is your question? Quiere que sí también cuando lleva where, pero no está, le ponemos where. Exactly. Ok, because this one is in negative. Porque es negativo. Ok, okay. entonces decimos no, no había. Ok. When you say, 
For example, yes, there were, sí, había. No, there weren't, no, no había. Okay. Si yo digo, yes, there was, sí, había. No, there wasn't, no había. ¿Cuál es la diferencia? Siempre significan lo mismo. La diferencia es que uno, usted lo utiliza para singular y el otro lo utiliza para plural. ¿Verdad? Ok. So, let's see. Now, were there two good wishes? ¿Habían dos buenas brujas? So, you say, in the movie? No, there weren't. Ok, no, there weren't. Exactly, because in the movie, we, ok, didn't have two wishes. Ok, now, in the book. Let's see. Were there silver shoes in the book? Were there? Okay. Yes, they are where. Si sí, había. We talk about plural, yes. Was there a tornado? Había un tornado? Okay. No, there wasn't. Yes, no, there wasn't. Were there red shoes? Habían zapatos cafés in the book? No, there weren't. Yes, no, there weren't. Okay, for example, imagine that, let me see, uh, we are in the classroom. Yeah, we were in the classroom the last week. Imagínese que estuvimos en el salón. Okay, so let's see. Mm, let me see. I have a microphone activate. Tengo un micrófono activado. Julio. Si me lo puede activar, porque yo no se lo puedo desactivar. Ok. Ok, gracias. Ok. No puedo desactivar el micrófono. No me da la opción. Ok. Ok, no se lo puedo desactivar. Ok, no me permite. Así que tiene que desactivarlo usted solo. Ok. So let's see. Ok, imagine that we are in the classroom, yes? Ok, we were in the classroom. So let's see, were there, okay, 20 desks? Habían 20 pupitres? What is your answer? No, there wasn't. No, okay, wasn't. listen to the question. Were there 20 desks? No, no, there weren't. Ah, okay, no, no there, there weren't. weren't. Exactly, okay. Imagine that, uh, let me see, we are, or we were in the mall, okay? Que estábamos en un centro comercial. Let's see. Was there a church? Había una iglesia? Was there a church? What is the answer? No, there wasn't. Okay, no, there wasn't. Okay, si la pregunta comienza con was, su, answer, su respuesta va a ser con was. Si la, la pregunta comienza con were there, su respuesta va a ser con there were. Yes? It is clear this part? Yes, okay. sir. Okay. So let's see. Light on grammar. Was there a witch? So we have two options. Yes, there was. No, there wasn't. One of these one is affirmative, the other one is negative. Una es positiva o afirmativa y la otra es negativa. Si sí había, no, no había. Were there any wizards? Ok. ¿Habían algunos magos? Yes, there were. No, there weren't. Si sí habían, no había. Yes? Ok. So, now we practice. Ok, let's see the first one. In that case is this one. Ok. So if you have a cross, that's mean the answer is in negative. If you have a, let me see, a little stick, that's mean this one is affirmative. Yes, okay. Were there apples here? Were there apples here? Were there any apples? What is the answer? 
Were there any apples? Okay. What is no, the answer? No, there were. Okay, no, there weren't. Yes, exactly. No, there weren't. Okay, was there an avocado? Was there an avocado? Había un aguacate? There was. Yes, there was. The, yes, no, there yes, there was. There was. Yes, there was, exactly, because we talk about only one. Yes, there was. Okay, were there any books? Were there any books? This one. Were there any books? What is the answer? Yes. There. Yes, there, yes, there were. were. Yes, yes, they are where. Okay. Recuerde que tiene que utilizar oraciones, ¿ok? No solamente decir yes or no. Ok, next one. Was there a ghost? Was there a ghost? ¿Había un fantasma? No, there was. No, there wasn't. No. Ok, no, so let's see. What, were there... Any uh, sleepers? I think this one are sleepers. No. What is that? Yes, there was. Okay, this one are sleepers or shoes? Shoes, yes. Yes, there Okay. Was. Okay, were there any shoes? Yes, there were another warrant. Yeah. And the last one was there. A witch? Was there a witch? Yes, there was. Yes, there was. Okay, so let's see. I didn't understand what is the, this picture. No entendí cuál era esta imagen. <laughs> I think there were shoes, yes? Okay, so let's see. Now, try to practice. Page number 68, please. So you listen and you circle the correct option. Yeah, so you have two options here. Pay attention, listen carefully, please, and you circle the correct option, okay? So let's start. One, two, three. Track 68. Listen and circle the correct option. Number one, a big cage. Number two, a lot of candy. Number three, a big black cat. Number four, cookies. Number five, a cookbook. Number six, fat spiders. Okay, number one, what is this? A big cage. A big cage. Okay, a big cage. Yes. Okay, Aaron, number two. Morning. A lot of ice cream. Okay. Is this going to a lot of ice cream? A lot of candy. A lot of candy is the correct option, yes? Okay. So let's see. Number three, Christopher Amaya. What is number three? No. Okay, listen again. Yes. Track sixty eight. Listen and circle the correct option. Number one, a big cage. Number two, a lot of candy. Number three, 
a big black cat. Number four, cookies. Number five, a cookbook. Number six, fat spiders. Okay, so that's me. Number three, what is the option? A big, a big black cat. Okay, excellent. A big black cat, exactly. Okay, next one. Ariana, what is number four? Okay. Mario, what is number four? Uh, cookies. Cookies, okay, excellent. So let's see, number five. What is number five, Jimena Vasquez? Hello, me. Hello, what is number five? A notebook. Okay, this one is a cookbook. Yes. And the last one, Dani Navas, number six. What is this one? Hello, me. Hello. Five and five. Oh, okay, fat spiders, yes. Okay, so let's see. Now we write sentences with there was and there were. For example, a big cage. So we talk about only one object or two or more. This is only one, two or more. A big cage. This is only one. For that reason, we use there was or there were. A big there cake. Was. Okay, there was. So we say there was a big cage. Yes. Okay. We talk about only one object. We write with there was. Yes. Okay. Number two, a lot of candy. Okay. One or two. Two or more. A lot of candy. More. Okay. A lot of candy. Check. Candy. We talk about only one. If this one is in plural, we say candies. Yes, but this one is in singular. So we say there was a lot of candy. Yeah. In that case, there was a lot of candy because this one is not in plural. Number three, a big black cat. One, two or more? One. Okay, one. That's being we use. There was a big black cat. Only one. There was a bia. Yes. Okay. Number four. Cookies. Singular or plural? Plural. 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 Okay, so we use there were cookies. Yes, habían galletas. There were cookies. Number five, a cookbook. Singular or plural? Singular. Singular. So we use there was a cookbook. And the last one, number six, fat spiders. Singular or plural? Plural. Plural, yes. So we use there were. There were fat spiders. Habían arañas gorditas. <laughs> okay, so let's see. I give you some minutes, yeah, for checking this part. Le voy a dar unos minutos para que termine esta parte, ¿sí? Okay, when you finish, you put a reaction, yes?
Ok. Vai vir. Excelente. I finish. Finish. Okay. Okay. So let's see. I have seven right now. Okay. One minute and then we continue. Finish. Excellent. Okay. Okay, thank you. Okay, so let's see. Now, okay. exercise two. We unscramble the questions. So we have some questions here, and it is necessary that we unscramble. That means we put in order all the words. In their spiders, where any the house. Okay, when you begin the question, you start first one with where or was. Excellent. So that's me. Question number one. We start where there any spiders in the house. Yes, this one is the correct order. Where there any spiders in the house. Había arañas en la casa? Ok. So, we invert. Ok. Lo ponemos al revés, por así decirlo. Were there any spiders in the house? Yes, this one is the correct order of the first question. Ok. What about number two? Dog there was a small. What is this one? What is the order of this question? Dog, there was a small. What is that? Okay, Ariana. Was there a small dog? Okay, thank you. Was there a small dog? Exactly, okay. Había un pequeño perro? Was there a small dog? Okay. Now. Number three, any brownies were there? Were any, were were there there any, brownies? any brownies? Okay, were there any brownies, exactly. Okay, were there any brownies? Number four, cage big there was a. Was there a big cage? Okay, was there a big cage? Había una jaula grande? Was there a big cage? Was there a bed? Okay, was there a bed? Yes, the last one. Was there a bed? Exactly. Okay, were there any spiders in the house? Was there a small dog? Were there any brownies? Was there a big cage? Was there a bed? Yes, and this one are the questions. Okay, and maybe we can answer. No, there weren't, number one. In number two, maybe we can say, yes, there was. In number three, yes, there were. In number four, um, yes, there was. And in the last one, no, there wasn't. Yes, it's the pen. Okay, so let's see. Okay, excellent participation. Thank you for paying okay. attention. And see you at 11 a.m., yes? Okay, nos vemos a las 11, nuestra clase de lengua. Lo voy a dejar ahí okay. para que termine de completar, los que aún no han terminado, ¿de acuerdo? Okay. Si usted no ha terminado, puede hacerlo ahorita. Okay, see you at 11. Bye-bye. <laughs> okay, bye.